Oh, what's up, guys? Lehman Griffin here, my dude. Got another uh, how-to for you today. First, I'm gonna eat breakfast, and I'm not starting this video outside because it's hot as crap out there. And frankly, I just don't feel like going out there yet. So I thought I'd shoot the introduction in here with my dog, Ranger. And uh, yeah, let's get started. I completely fell asleep. So let's go get started now. Bam, just like that, we're down here in the garage. Today's video, 2019 Silverado, we're gonna be pulling some interior trim pieces, your bezel around your radio, and also your trim ring around your cup holders so that you can wrap them, paint them, whatever you wanna do, or if you just need to get access behind there. If you'll, if you'll just give me like two seconds, we gotta wash this thing because it's really filthy, so two seconds and, and then we'll be done. All right, may, maybe four or five seconds or six probably six seconds ten let's go ten seconds now let's let's do six seconds that will be good all right truck is clean where were we oh pulling the uh, radio bezel out let's do this all right so this one's pretty simple straightforward let's see I think last time we just grabbed a tool off of here. I don't even remember. I think it was like a, where the heck is it? Ah, here it is. All right, same tool. We're gonna use the same tool we used last time. Rubber, pry bar, I, uh, whatever. Anyway, let's do this. So you're gonna walk into your truck, step one get in your truck step two turn on the air conditioner oh oh rubber squeegee looking thing you're gonna go to your um, your bezel and you're gonna take your rubber squeegee and you're gonna lightly push right here on this chrome and I say on the chrome because I've got a wrap and I don't want to pop it off and you're just gonna start prying just ever so gingerly Sometimes it doesn't want to come up here, so we can start at the bottom. Let's go in between here. Every time I do this, I think I'm gonna break it. There we go. So you saw that, right? You see how it's just pulled away here? So pry bar in there. Pull it right away, and then we're gonna go up a little higher. Same thing, pull it away, a little higher. And then we get up here, we can go behind our vent. We're just gonna twist. There we go, see that? Sounded like it broke, but it didn't. So now we've got this whole side of it out. Now you don't wanna put any pressure on it, you wanna just kinda of leave it the way it is. Start on this side, same thing. A little prime motions. There you go. Pops away. There you have it. It is literally that simple. Now I'll show you what's on this that actually holds it in. So you can see there's a clip there, clip there. Clip there, clip there, clip there, clip there, clip there, clip there, and clip there. So overall, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Wait, no, one, two, three, four, five, nine. Nine total clips. I don't know why I couldn't count that. Nine total clips holding it into your center console or your dash, and then you can see what's behind it. That's that. That's pulling your bezel off of your radio. And uh, to put it back in, it's real simple. I don't, I don't even need to take this off. I just did it to show you. So putting it back in, set it in place. Line up your top clips first. 
and you're gonna snap those down in. There you go. And then you're just gonna work your way towards the bottom. And that's it. How to remove your radio bezel, 2019 Silverado. Uh, next up, we're gonna do how to remove your cup holder trim. Actually, let's just go ahead and do that same video. Yeah, let's do that. I've never done this before, so wish me luck. All right, so I think first thing we're gonna do is pull this rubber off. I'll tell you what, this little pry tool comes in handy. Rubber off, now we're gonna remove it. Mm, that's, we'll see how that works. Maybe, maybe we don't remove it, maybe we just hold it away from there so we can get our squeegee or our rubber thing down in here. Let's try this. There it is. So I just lightly lifted. You can see, I'm really scared to pull up too much. There it goes. Bam. Just took a little persuasion, didn't break any clips. I call that a win. So I'll show you what's behind this. These little tabs, and they actually grab a hold of the outside of the trim ring. So my advice when you're pulling these up, don't do like I did and try to pry from the, well, I mean, you can, but if you pry from the inside, it's gonna be harder. If you pry from the outside and you get right where these locations are, it'll you'll be able to pop them out. But you can see that if you're gentle, no matter how you do it, it's really gonna uh, come out with success. You're not gonna worry about it. Just if you start to hear any cracking, let off. That's it, chrome trim ring. Um, let's put it back on. Now pay attention when you're putting it back on. If you look here, you can see that there on the ends, there's an offset tab on one side. This side's on the left side. And over here on the right side. So basically you're gonna make it to where the tabs, the offset tabs are in the back. You can see there's a hole here, there's not a hole up front. Hole here, not a hole up front. So put the tabs by the hole in the back. And then you're just gonna snap it in. And take your rubber and basically just push it back and there's there's little holes that it'll kind of fall into there you go. there's a little rubber sleeve you want to push down into that and that'll hold it real tight up against the edge same thing on this side you can see there's a gap right now and if I pull that out the rubber tab is probably not in the hole let's pry this Yeah. I guess 
that's it. There you go. I've never done that before, so props to me. Uh, removing the chrome trim on your center console bezel, removing the radio bezel. We've already handled the door panel inserts there and the console inserts. Next, we're gonna tackle removing the whole door panels, so be sure and subscribe, like the video, give it a thumbs up. Be sure and hit the bell so you get notifications when I put up new videos, and we will see you in the next one. Oh my gosh, I'm so glad I'm done filming that video. It's so freaking hot outside. My hat is just covered. What's up, dudes? What is it? Let me smell the Oh my god, look at all these dogs. Where do all these dogs come from? It's like a pile of dogs. Alright, upstairs.